I think in his brain. And his, his, he didn't relate, did he? Let's get to the weather now with Jules. <laughs> Hello there. Well, how lovely to open the curtains this morning and see the sun rising. A real contrast with this time last week. Monday last got off to a really miserable grey old start. But today, plenty of blue sky and sunshine from Bedford right across the region. And here's today's satellite picture showing why, yes, we've had some areas of cloud, but some decent breaks too, allowing this sunshine through. And in the sun, out of the wind, it felt really quite warm, positively spring-like. And there is more of that on the way. Overnight tonight, looks like it'll be dry. We'll have some long clear spells and probably some patchy mist and fog too and a frost because I think we're going to have similar temperatures to last night. Ones and twos generally but we could see something a bit lower in some spots down to around minus one with mainly light southwesterly winds. So it's high pressure that keeps us in charge uh, tomorrow so it looks like these weather fronts will stay away to the north and west and it's another fine and dry day. A chilly start but the fog and the frost should clear and then we're probably going to see this cloud increasing but we should still have some breaks and a bit of brightness coming through even during the afternoon. One or two showers but I think for most of us it will be dry with highs of around 10 or 11 degrees Celsius, that's the low 50s Fahrenheit and again light to moderate southwesterly winds. And then it's a very similar pressure setup for Wednesday so again I think we're looking at a fine and dry day. Yes we'll have some areas of cloud moving through but also some decent breaks allowing some sunshine and brightness as well and temperatures remaining above average. They should be around 7 or 8 degrees at this time of year but again on Wednesday we're looking at about 10 or 11 degrees Celsius that's the low 50s Fahrenheit and then spot the difference for Thursday the center of the high migrates a little further eastwards but it's really more of the same right the way through the working week and possibly through much of the weekend too we may just see the cloud increasing on Sunday and eventually some rain pushing in from the west but look at those temperatures 10 to 12 degrees Celsius we keep the winds from a southerly direction so very mild by day but I have to say we are going to have some colder nights on some nights as you can see we will have temperatures close to freezing if not a little bit below so there will be a frost on some nights but generally the week ahead high pressure dominating so dry and mild by day some days seeing more sunshine than others but we have got some cold and frosty nights too and that's the forecast bye bye <laughs>